and you can see you can see how the way the screen is flashing right now you can't really do anything it's just flashing I'm gonna show you how to fix this the only way to do this is to go through safe mode and make some a little bit adjustments uh, without further ado let's get started first we click on the control button and control alt delete which takes us to another platform okay let me try control alt delete okay then if you look on the bottom right you will see a power button just here you click on it then you see a restart button you click on that then it um, reboots to restart and takes you to the safe mode but I'm not going to do this because uh, it's going to stop my recording so I'm going to there's uh, different ways to do this I'm still going to show you another way okay let's go back there are other ways to do this there are other ways to change to safe mode please check the link below Sorry. hold down the shift key and then click on the reset button then it's going to bring a blue screen that is another menu called uh, choose an option then go to troubleshooting then it changes to another blue screen which is the advanced options click on the startup button startup setting I mean then it changes to another blue screen which gives you list of options to choose from then you are gonna click on the restart button which is going to reboot your system and take you to another blue screen with list of options to choose from so then click on F5 for the selection of safe mode with networking once it boots up in safe mode then click on Windows key and R which opens the run tab here okay uh, then type in msconfig.exe then click on ok okay which opens this tab here click on services then click on this service here to alphabetize everything then scroll down search for windows error reporting services
Okay, yeah, here it is. Untick it. Untick Windows Error Reporting Services. The, and search for Problem Reports and Solution. Yes, this is it. Untick it. Then you click on apply and click on OK. Then reboot it. Once you reboot it, then the flashing problem is solved. If you like my video, please click on the subscribe button below. Thank you.